So you've tried mounting your antlers all sorts of different ways over the years, but you're looking for something that's different. I've got a video for you. Hello everybody, this is Nathan Nelson with Stillwater Outdoors, and in this video today I've got something very unique for you. I'm going to show you how to make a drift wood European mount. So it was super simple to make this thing. First of all, you need to have a European mount. I'm not going to show you how to do all of the European stuff. This deer that I found here was a deadhead that was out in the woods. It's a beautiful deer, measures 143 inches with a broken brow tie, and so it was about 145 inch big woods deer. Monster of a buck. So I wanted to really do him justice. So what I did was I went to a, a nearby river and I found this piece of driftwood. So step one in trying to construct this type of European mount is that you need to find a piece of good driftwood. Now you can find these on rivers, you can find them on lakes, you just gotta go around and try to find something. One thing that you'll notice about this driftwood piece is that it is part of the root structure of a tree. So the tree used to be on this side and it was just starting to go up the base of the tree right here and this was the root system that went out. Now I think that the root system is what looks really cool for something like this. So go to a nearby river or a nearby lake and just walk the shoreline. See if you can find these down trees. Step two. Now when you find the right type of driftwood for your mount, you want to get the right angle of your cut if possible. Otherwise you can do that when you get home. Just make sure that you leave enough space on this. But I wanted to get this about where it looks like the antlers are parallel to the ground. I don't like seeing these antlers that are tipped way back like this. Uh, I want it to be nice and parallel, right like this. So I tried to make this cut so that it would make this parallel. Step three. Now you're going to need to attach your European mount to your driftwood. Now I believe that there is some taxidermy stuff that you can use that's much better than screws, but in my case, I attached this skull to this driftwood by just using screws. Now you need to make sure that you screw into a spot that you've semi pre-drilled and that you can get this thing in without breaking the skull. So I pre-drilled a small hole through this and I punched it in right there and then it went up into the base on the bottom of this skull. I did that there and then I also did that through the inside of this groove here and just put two screws in there and that was enough to hold it. Now it's not something that I want to shake it and you know knock it around but I definitely have it strong enough that it will hold. Step four, you need to drill this hole right here and then put a bracket over this. Now this is going to be in place so that you can hang this on a wall on a screw. You wanna make sure that you make this strong enough and that you use a screw that is strong enough to hold this entire thing because there's a lot of weight pulling down on that one little spot. So make sure you make it strong enough. You don't want the thing crashing down and breaking some of these special antlers that you have. But there you guys have it. That is a quick and simple, easy way for you guys to do a really unique deer mount for your next buck. Thanks for watching, guys. Be sure to like and subscribe to my channel.